All right, for all those out there watching this video, we are talking about how to French kiss. And I have a great formula for you to use so you can easily remember what to do when you're doing this, whether it's for the first time, the first time with a new girl, or maybe it's just something you've been doing wrong all along with women that you've been meeting. So now you're gonna know how to fix it and how to be the most amazing kisser. And I'm telling you right now, is when you implement this formula, what's gonna happen is you are going to get women who are going to tell you verbally to your face, wow, you're a good kisser. And what happens when you're a good kisser? Well, what ends up happening is she's gonna to wanna to kiss you more and then it can escalate to more things like sex and it can even go further of her just knowing that she wants to be with you because it's very attractive when a man knows how to kiss and has that skill because you're going to be doing it a lot and you can really turn a woman off if you don't know how to kiss right. So this is why you have to use this formula. Real quick, if you want to know how to eventually get to the point where you are meeting women who you have the option to do this with. A lot of guys are thinking like, Trip, I love that I'm learning how to French kiss and you're teaching me how to do it, but I don't have any women to do it with. Well, you're gonna wanna check out my Hooked program. The Hooked program is down below. It's a program that teaches you how to meet women, how to attract women, and how to get to the point where you are actually using this formula. So if you need a whole course that teaches you what to do, steps A to Z, the Hooked program is going to help you. Go to getherhooked.com or go down below and click that link and it's gonna teach you everything that you need to know to get to the point where you are successfully meeting women that you're attracted to in your town. Okay, and you're gonna know exactly what to do step by step once you go through the program. Okay, so what's the formula? The formula is CST. So what that stands for is C, we're talking about closeness, okay? This one is kind of obvious, but a lot of guys don't realize that this is the key to actually get the kiss started, okay? So in order to get the kiss started, there's nothing special you have to do. Guys are really scared of getting rejected. By the way, a long time ago, when I was learning this stuff, I was very scared of rejection, specifically with kissing. Kissing was the hardest thing to do, and then that landed me in the friend zone when I couldn't actually go for the kiss, and then the girl thought, oh, I guess we're just friends, and he's not being dominant, this isn't sexy, and bye-bye. So, how do you start the kiss? The best thing you can do is you can go close to her, okay? So C stands for close. You're gonna be getting close to her. It's very hard to kiss a girl when she's too far away, or maybe you have to like step and go for the kiss, okay? So you wanna be close to her. So you wanna create a moment where you guys can be close. So what can that be? That can be she's over at your place and you're on the couch and you guys are close to each other. Maybe you're saying goodbye and it's the end of the date and you guys are close to each other so you're gonna get close to her, okay? And part of this also is creating a silence, okay? That's not actually what the S stands for in CST, but just understand that if you wanna create this moment, you're gonna get close to her, but you're also gonna create a silence, which means you're not gonna say a word, and then she's gonna stop talking eventually, and then you're gonna go for it. But most importantly, it's about getting close. That's gonna make it so much easier for you to initiate this kiss. Next is S, which again, doesn't stand for silence. S stands for slow, okay? I've talked about this in my other videos about kissing. You wanna go slow. This is one of the most important parts of this formula because guys mess this up. Now, of course, you can go too slow, but I don't think you're going to. I think most guys err on the side of going too fast. So I just wanna slow you down. Slow kissing is sensual, it's sexy, it's gonna turn her on more because she's gonna be a little bit more teased since you're not really going for it. And also, it's gonna show that you're not eager. And guys who are really eager, who go very fast and, and just, get right to it, meaning like you just like plant your face really quickly into her lips and you're moving your tongue very fast and all that stuff, you gotta slow down. When you're slowed down, it creates a more sensual experience. So when you're kissing her, make sure it's slow. Of course, you don't have to go slow the entire time. It's kind of like a dance. You're gonna kiss her and for a moment it might go a little bit fast. Maybe it's gonna slow down a little bit more. You're gonna kind of go in this kind of wave, like up and down, up and down, slow, then fast, and slow, then fast. But if anything, you wanna go slow, and if you go slow most of the time, it's gonna be more sexy. It turns her on more. So make sure, again, to recap here, C, close, get close. 
Wait for the silence, go for the kiss. Then you're gonna be slow with it. Then we're gonna move to T. T stands for tongue. And what I mean is you wanna use less tongue than you think. I know that French kissing is with a tongue and that's the difference between a French kiss and just a little peck on the lips, okay? But you actually wanna use less tongue. This is going to be a lot more sexy and also build more of that tension up and make for a more tr intriguing and sensual kiss using less tongue. So if we had to divide this into some sort of ratio, I would say it would be about 65, 70% no tongue, 30% tongue. So finally, when you are using your tongue in a French kiss and you're moving your tongue around and it's going in and it's going out, it's more fun and more sexy when it gets to that part when there finally is tongue. So what you're doing when you're not using tongue, obviously, is you're just kissing with open lips. That way, it's still a French kiss. It's getting a little bit more wet than a normal peck, okay? But when you can control your tongue, and by the way, combine this with S, which is slow, so you're using just a little bit of tongue and you're going slow, and of course, you guys are close to each other. This is gonna be the best kiss of her life. Guys who are over eager and don't know how to use their tongues and use their bodies and be able to really understand what a woman wants. If you're not doing this, she's going to be turned off. And if you are doing it correctly, she's gonna be incredibly turned on. So you can remember this as you're going through, right? So C, close, S, slow, T, tongue, which stands for just about 30% tongue. And of course, again, like I said, it might not be the whole time you're going slow or the whole time are you using 30% tongue. It might go, you know, ebb and flow and go in these different waves as you're doing it, but you'll feel that and you'll feel that energy when you're actually going for it. For those of you who have not done a lot of French kissing, maybe I'm talking to some of the younger guys out there, don't fret, just go for it, try it out. It might be weird at first. I remember the first time I ever kissed a girl, French kissed a girl, it was when I was in like eighth grade many years ago. I had no idea, I didn't have YouTube to watch to learn this. But you just know, instinctually you know what to do. However, it's not always instinctual to be close, to start it, to go slow, and to use 30% tongue. Okay, so those are the things that you're gonna wanna implement, but once you're doing it, your body is just gonna know what to do, okay? So, trust yourself, go for it, and make sure that if you don't know what you're doing here, and you want more opportunities to even practice this video, get the Hooks program. It will change your life because it's gonna teach you everything in a full course on what to do to meet the women that you're really interested in, not the one that you're settling for. It's an eight to 10 hour course teaching you everything about flirting, attraction, female psychology, talking to women, getting them interested in you with your personality and being your genuine self. Link down below, getterhook.com. Hope this helps. Press like if it does. Use the CST formula and I'll see you in the comments.